Welcome back, one and all, to Thionite Plays, Stardew Valley 1.6. On the last episode, it was a Wednesday, and we did Wednesday exclusive things, like pick the hops. And today, we're going to do something that is Thursday exclusive. Picking the hops, but from the bottom to the top. If you are from an upside-down reversed world, because I did technically pick them from the top to the bottom bottom but that doesn't matter we have fish and we need to fish today because i want to get a fish specifically the sturgeon by the end of the day i need to get a sturgeon by the end of summer because our next opportunity will come in winter but i do not want to go for a sturgeon in winter because that's an entire season away and i want to get that out of the way so we'll be doing that i have bait and we'll be using the special bait because well we have it i'll also bring a trap bobber because why wouldn't I use those things? Where did the bait go? What happened to the bait? Oh, did they? Oh, it probably went in there. Right, that's that's how that works. Interesting. We also have mail, but let's put all of this stuff on the fishing rod. And then we can do the chores, and then we can do other things. We have a skeletal tail for Gunther. Someone wanted a diamond. I think it was Pierre. And if we're in Pierre's shop, we'll stop by Caroline to give her the spangle, and then that'll be fine. Uh, mail. Right. Ah, lightning. Scary. Dear Colin Derwall, I'd like to share an old cooking recipe my pappy used to make. It's important that the fish is fresh. Wiley's clam chowder. Oh, that's going to be a nice recipe to get once we have a kitchen. Because we don't have a kitchen, and I don't want to try and make a chowder over an open flame. To Farmer Colin Derwall, my knee's acting up again, and you know what helps? Rubbing the darn thing with hot peppers. Uh, didn't I just give you a hot pepper? Fine. You're lucky I still have some, and I'm willing to be generous. Where you have, you can have one of those. You also like a leak, right? Do you have... Where... Who? George, right? Where's George on this list? All the way at the bottom? Okay, no gifts. Fine, I'll give the man a leak as well. I have leaks, right? I do have leaks? I have leaks. He can have a leak as well. If we're going over there, we might as well. Where's my hops? Are they in this chest? I don't know where anything is. I never know where anything is at any given time. But we do also have some vegetables that are done. And by vegetables, I mean the squash and the sunflowers and coffee beans. All right, we have some stuff. I'm going to pick the stuff because, well, I'm a man who loves to collect things. So we're also going to take... Ooh, nice. We got some oak resin as well. We definitely need to make more tappers at some point. That is absolutely something that needs to get prioritized. Because if we don't, I don't know what I'm going to do. Get out of here, you stupid tree. Where is the normal bait? I have bait. Put all of this stuff in there that I cannot pick up because whatever. All right, fine. Let's put all the vegetables away and then we can deal with the fish later. The only goal for today, we missed an eggplant or a squash. The only like major goal that we have is the sturgeon. That's, that's the big thing that I want. And I feel like that is well within our abilities to do. Uh, where is everything? Everything else is probably in this chest. Yeah, the squash, I definitely want... The stuff we get from these seed bags, I definitely want to save for when we get seed makers. Otherwise, I would probably start selling and uh, doing stuff with them. Uh, where was... Uh, this can go in there. That also can go in there. We only need five more row before we're done with that, which is great. Um, the acorn, that goes somewhere else. Right, we love managing our inventories. There's nothing we like more. There is absolutely nothing in this world that's better than micromanaging inventories. I cannot wait until I set up everything with big chests, because that would be the goal. Uh, let's put all of this in there in the hot bar. Who wanted the diamond? It was Pierre. George wants a hot pepper. Pierre wants a diamond. We'll get some tickets from that, I think. And let's get the mayo. And pet all of our lovely creatures. And the duck egg. Um, I think I'm going to save duck eggs for the immediate future. I think we're just going to stick with um, normal mayo. Why did I only get... Did I miss an egg? Did I miss an egg? I did miss an egg. It blended with the chickens. Everyone gets pets. Pets, 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 pets. Everyone gets pets today and everyone gets the eggs. Take the egg. Take the egg, my dear mail machines, and prove your most invaluable worth. Uh, let's go drop off 
all of the gifts, and then we can go and do some fishing. With all of the bait, the bonuses, and the upgraded fishing rod that we have, sturgeon should not be a problem by any stretch of the imagination. Yes, that, that, that's definitely the case. I've been thinking, one of the special things that we need for the community center bundle, specifically the bulletin board bundle, is a truffle. And we did a cave carrot. Pam wants a cave carrot. I can do that. Uh, Wiley's birthday. I gave... Did I give him a diamond? If I didn't, it... Well, I can check. I did give him a gift. Okay, so at least we managed to do that. Uh, we'll go to Pam as well. Pierre, diamond for you. Diamond delivery. And we got a prize ticket. Nice. Thank you, Pierre. Where is your wife? I have a desire. And a flower. Oh, she's in the normal place. That's great. I have a summer spangle for you, Caroline. Thank you. Oh, I've already given Caroline two gifts this week. Oh, fine. Someone else. I'll give I'll give Granny Evelyn the flower. I'm sure she'll appreciate it. Because if she doesn't, well, then I'll be most upset. Because someone else would have probably appreciated the flower. Demetrius. Hi, Demetrius. Uh, Pam wants a cave carrot. Uh, let me go. Let me just go really quick back to the farm. Get that cave carrot. Why is Demetrius going to the doctor? Is Harvey blackmailing him with explicit photos? Who knows what Harvey keeps in those doctorate files of his? All those manila folders, they hold untold secrets. Untold secrets. I'm going to actually keep the Summer Spangle. If, if, if Caroline doesn't want the thing, well, she's not getting it. What am I here for? Cave carrot. Where is, where, where are my stock of cave carrots? I do have cave carrots, right? They better be somewhere. I can... I have normal carrots. I do have cave carrots. Nice. Hopefully, I'll get a second ticket for that. Because we did... I need to get rid of the old bed. It's fine. It's fine. Rainy summer days are the thing that... It, rainy summer days is the time of day and the season and the weather where sturgeon have the highest percent chance on average of spawning so we should at least get one but i would like two at minimum so that's that uh george i have several things i have a leak for you first which is something you love and a hot pepper so enjoy enjoy my old wrinkly friend even though we are not really friends Pam, you're here. Um, cave carrot for you. Thank you so much. Did I not get a ticket for that? Do I only get one? Can I only have one ticket at a time? I could have sworn. Oh, well, whatever. I If I missed out on a ticket, there'll be more opportunities. There will indeed be more opportunities. The lightning is striking forever. Let's go get whatever the reward is. I think the reward are mushroom logs. Morning, Lewis. I'm here for a reward. My mushroom logs. And a pomegranate sap. Sapling. Mega bombs. Eh, that's not a super interesting one. But we'll have to find a place for these mushroom logs to see what they do. They need to be surrounded by trees? It grows mushrooms every so often. The more wild trees are nearby, the better it works. So we'll probably put that in the northern part of the farm. Because I don't have any other areas of the farm with a lot of natural trees. Gunther, I have a bone. I have a bone to pick with you. Haha, <laughs> it's an archaeologist joke. I didn't get a reward from it, but, you know, G-Man, you don't are- You're not under any obligation to reward me every time I give you things. Because unlike some people, I do things out of the goodness of my heart. One single rock. I'm glad I went up here and picked that out. Pam, I don't suppose you'd be willing to give me a ticket. Hey there, farmer. Well, hi, hi, Pam. Have a fantastic rest of your rainy day in the Joge's place. I get rid of that town eventually. Or, the shopping center in the town. I won't get rid of the town unless they annoy me, which, you know, is not an impossibility, but it's unlikely. Hopefully we get these sturgeon quickly. But that thing I was talking about that I completely forgotten and already just now remembered. <gasps> Bubbles. Hopefully we could do that quickly. Is this enough to get perfect catch? Nice. A perfect catch is enough with the bubbles. Hopefully we can get these stir. I think this might be a sturgeon. If this, I'll, st I'll still, don't worry. I haven't forgotten about that thing that I mentioned about the truffles. Is this a sturgeon? It is a sturgeon. Oh my god, we got that so quickly. I need at least one more. I need at least one more sturgeon, please. This is not a sturgeon. But, since the fish are lucrative in this reality, I will catch them. I have no problem catching the fish. 
And hopefully with the bubbles, the bait, the bobber, and the iridium rod, we'll catch them so easily. Because with all of the fishing upgrades that we've gotten our hands on recently, I don't think it's out of the realm of possibility to get the lava eel and the scorpion carp relatively quickly. But that thing I was talking about with the stupid truffles, one of the community center bundle items we need for the bulletin board bundle is a truffle. And we only get the truffles from pigs once we have a tier three, a deluxe barn. And it might be a bit bothersome to go and get that because, well, we'd have to build a barn and then we'd have to, you know, build an upgrade to a barn and then another upgrade to a barn. And that's probably going to cost us several dozens of thousands of dollars, probably upwards of like... I don't know, like 60 grand probably. And that's going to take time. And even if we do get the barn relatively quickly and easily, if we don't get the pigs, you know, um, fully grown and, you know, healthy and truffle hunting age before winter, they won't go out and get truffles by the end of year one. So, and that's not, you know, a giant massive deal doing the community center by the end of year one. It's entirely likely and entirely possible that the traveling saleswoman has more truffles. I really am regretting not buying one. I, the thing was, though, when she was selling them, I think she sold them for like four grand. I didn't have the money at that point. I already... I need one more sturgeon, please. But I, I was thinking, we're probably going to sell more things quicker... Just because we need more money for various things. I want to upgrade the house and I want to get a barn going. The sooner we get a barn, the sooner and easier we get those pigs hunting truffles. And that's just going to be helpful regardless of when that happens. But that'll be... That'll be the goal. I think I think the house and a barn. Because the house is only 10 grand. And the barn is only... Like 5 or 6 to start out with. So I'm not super worried about that. But we do need to focus. One of the things... Oh, this is another sturgeon. Fantastic. Hopefully we can do this. Then we can take this to the community center and finish that bundle. But one of the things I want to do is I want to get more fish smokers. So I think we need to fish in the uh, the ocean. One of the things that's going to happen is fall has the rest of the fish that we need after the sturgeon that is on the line right now. Yes. Uh, now that we have both of the sturgeons... The only fish that we need for the bundles are in fall. Where is the fish bundle? Fish tank. Tiger trout, that's in fall. Walleye and eel, those are in fall. The lake fish we're going to complete. And the master fisher bundle we can do whenever. Because, well, we can go get the lava eel in floor 100 of the mines. And we can go get the scorpion carp whenever we do that. And if, that, if we don't prioritize paying for the, uh, the vault bundle to get to Calico Desert, then we can, worst case scenario, get the blobfish during the night market. So we should, at absolute minimum, get the fish tank relatively quickly. So what do we get for the lake fish? I only need one sturgeon. So drop off a sturgeon, then we have another sturgeon for a fish pond. So what's our reward? A dressed spinner. Wow. I was about to say, did our sturgeon disappear? It did not. So we don't need that bait anymore, and we don't need that bobber. Put that on there. Okay, so that's good. So we got some fish. We got a sturgeon. That's fantastic. Another bundle down. And we got a dressed spinner, which doesn't really help us, but that's fine. So rainy day complete. Complete indeed. Uh, let me do one last check of the um, calendar. Okay, it's no one's birthday, but the bookseller is going to be in the next episode, so that's fine. Yeah, um, the last two episodes, you know, this one and the next one will be the second to last day and the last days of summer. So, that's the plan for that. So, what are we going to do for the rest of the day? I don't rightly know. Maybe we chop down trees? Let's decide on what we need to sell, because we do need to decide on stuff to sell. This, 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 all goes away. This as well, this, this. Right, okay, so that's all in there. Let's let's put the tree stumps down and then decide on what needs to be sold because things do need to be sold. Uh, the sturgeon can go away. Ooh, the pickles are done. Yeah, I think I am just going to sell a bunch of stuff tonight because we have a lot of stuff. Nael, I'm glad you're doing well. I'm sorry that it's raining, but I can't do much to fix that. What do I need for kegs? I have two oak resins. I need... Iron and copper. How much wood do I have? 
Don't break any of my stupid plants. I need those. Um, the wood. We don't have any... We have uh, we have enough for two, so let me just get two iron bars smelting. That way we can, at minimum, have two kegs going, because we do need that. Uh, I would like to put the oak resin to use for stuff like the wheat and the hops that we have, because that would be a nice little quick source of income. So, right, the mushroom logs, and we can drop off everything else. The pickled corn. Right, pickled corn. Homemade pickles. Pickled pickled corn. Interesting. Probably not as tasty as you might expect, but give me the rest of this mayo. Give me the mayo. I really want the mayo in my pocket. I don't want mayo in my pocket. That would just be um, not good. But uh, what are we doing? We have a lot of blueberries. Should we make uh, blueberry jelly? I think we should make some blueberry jelly. Why the heck not? Uh, right. Let's let's go put the um, the uh, mushroom logs somewhere. They're only one by one, so it's not a, a large amount of space to dedicate. So I think we need to clear out this area potentially. Put one down here, I guess. Stone, stone. Where's the wood? Sure. Um, we'll put one. We'll put one there, and then a rest. The rest of this stuff that can go away definitely needs to go away. All of this needs to vanish. Why are there so many trees? Hopefully, by putting a bunch of these mushroom logs down, we'll get more income from mushrooms. We do. I do kind of want to get a dehydrator from Pierre, because we did get a lot of money. We did get like nearly like a little bit over two grand from that diamond for Pierre so I think I'm going to I think I am going to invest in a dehydrator just to see what that's about because if it's in, in any way as profitable as the fish smokers then I definitely want to dedicate some money to that which may or may not be helpful I'm already feeling exhausted how is such a thing possible? Where is the way up to... Why is there a tree by the bridge? That's a terrible place for it. Uh, fine, though. Um, we'll put another... We'll put another mushroom log here, right in the middle. Another one here, and... Just to save on travel space. I guess I could just put one here as well. Sure. I don't know if that's the most effective place for those, but it's where we have a dense conglomeration of trees so that's fine let's uh make the keg now that we have keg making material put all that stuff away drop off the bars uh drop off the seeds perfect um right so we need two copper two steel some wood and the oak resin so let's make the two kegs. Fantastic. How much wood do I need for preserve jars? 50 of each. Well, I have stone and coal, so we have the wood for it. Actually, I'm going to save the wood because we need more wood for the house. So that's going to be kept to a minimum of usage. Uh, let me just put the kegs there. What are we going to put in the kegs, you may be wondering? Um, Pam wants a pale ale, doesn't she? What do we need for a pale ale? Pale ale is either wheat, hops, or something else. Um, I'm just going to put in some wheat. I think that should be the first thing that we do. Um, right, so give me one of those and give me one of those. If they give me pale ale, that's fine. Should I? I'll hedge my bets and put hops in one of them. Where is the hops? Where are my hops? I don't know where they are. Found one. Cool. Um, yeah, I'll hedge my bets and put wheat in one and hops in the other and whenever they're done we'll find out which one pale pale likes no pam likes dear pamela no um what do we what else do we need to do i don't think there's anything oh let's get the fish smoking we've been missing out on an opportunity to do that um right coral we can't smoke coral unfortunately uh let's smoke let's smoke up some pike, I suppose. 
We only have three bits of coal in here? That's, that's not enough. It's concerning that there are so many lightning strikes. Can I make more batteries? Iron bars. Oh, we need to go. We need to go to the mines and get more iron. We don't have enough. We do not have enough. Um, let me do more smelting. Because we have three can go away and then that. I think that's enough for all of the smelters. We're one short, but that's fine. The fish will smoke. The copper will smelt. And then we can just keep doing that for the rest of the day. I don't know how long it takes for the mushroom logs to accumulate mushrooms. Because I don't know if it's um, something that takes like it, like an everyday type thing. Like the um, mushroom cave. Because the mushroom cave, if you choose that instead of the, um, the, uh, m uh, the fruit bats, they're self-replenishing every day. So that should be... A curious thing to test. I'm thinking about all of these melons. We have a lot of melons, and I firmly believe that with all of the melon proceeds, we will absolutely have enough money to afford a barn and a house. So that should be good. Uh, let's get the pike going. Let's get everything ready to sell that we want to sell. Because then we can probably... Ooh, I probably... Oh, we don't have enough energy. Um, hmm... Hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm, everything is a big hmm. How am I going to get wood easy? I probably want to just sell a bunch of stuff. Um, let me take all the smoked fish out of here. And then nothing else in here needs to be sold. So let's just sell all this nonsense. And we'll sell everything? Should we sell everything? Because we've got, we've got gold mayo, we've got other things. Yeah, we're going to sell everything. Everything that we have that should be sold will be sold. And we'll make a lot of money from that. Hopefully all this lightning is not killing an immense amount of crops. Or if it is, it's killing crops that aren't producing a lot. Maybe I should do corn seeds. I need to make corn seeds. Um, what do I want to buy? It's 10.50. I do want to cut down more trees. Do I have anything I can eat really quickly for a bit of energy? I need to... I, need, I want to cut down some trees with the rest of the time. Yeah, with the rest of the time today, we'll just cut down some trees. What do I have to... What do I have to munch on? What is a good snack to munch on? Hops? Not necessarily. Um, grapes? I, I'm just... Yeah, I'm extremely concerned with all of the, the lightning killing all of our crops it's always a curiosity and a terror we're always struck with immense amounts of fear why do i have two largemouth bass there's not supposed to be a largemouth bass in that chest no there is not you go in the largemouth bath bath fish chest nope we're wasting time i'm wasting time just yammering on crab cakes F strange bun no i need a strange bun for vincent's place i don't want to deprive myself of that I should really upgrade the farmhouse so I can have a kitchen so I can cook some eggs to snack on um I'm just gonna eat some raw sunflowers Haley will understand yeah I'm just gonna eat some raw sunflowers and w with the rest of the time today we're just gonna cut down a bunch of trees because I need the wood hopefully we'll have enough wood for or, at the very least, hopefully we'll be able to get enough wood today and tomorrow to upgrade the house. I firmly expect that with all of the stuff that we've sold, we should definitely get enough money for a house upgrade. We'll do the house upgrade first, then we'll focus on a barn and go for the pigs. If we don't get the um, the community center done in the first year, that's not a big deal. I'm not going to make that a priority in this particular playthrough. So, give me until like 1.30. I'll only cut down a few trees, but I will be cutting down trees. We only ended up doing that for a short time and got 96 pits of wood, but we also got some, um, what's this called? Lawn moss. Normal moss. But that's fine. Once we find a use for the moss, that'll be fantastic. Nothing on the Queen of Sods. What's the weather for tomorrow like? A storm. Ooh, a storm. 
I really wish I had more lightning rods. Let's see how much money we make. From farming, nearly 1,200. And from fishing, nearly 600. Or 6,000. That's good. So, lots of money from that. Iridium smoked chubs for 250. Smoked shad. Interesting. A lot of this fish is probably good. The smoked pike? That's really good, though. Good smoked fish. That's good. Lots of money from that. With all of the money we have, that should put us over 20 grand. Probably. Just barely. A few hundred past 20 grand, which is fine. How many crops did we lose in the night? Hopefully not a lot, but that's fine. The next episode, all of our melons will be done, and we'll put them to use. Probably just immediately by selling them. So let's get the fish row. Let's check the mushroom logs to see if they're, you know, producing... I don't know what I need to do to harvest them. It doesn't seem like they're producing mushrooms at the moment, but that's fine. We'll deal with that as the situation requires. Uh, fish eggs. Fish eggs? No, chicken eggs and duck eggs, but only every other day. Right, 20 grand. Let's hope we can get enough money for uh, the house upgrade. Why am I always missing an egg? Oh, they blend in so well. I need to get an auto co collector. Auto grabber. Auto collector. I need to get one of those. It'd be so easy. Did I... Was there a duck egg? No. I'm just going to assume that there was no duck egg. Wait, I, sorry. I'm just going in and out and in and out. I need to drop off a bunch of hay because I don't want my animals to starve. They haven't been able to go out and get their bluegrass in several days, but that's fine. Uh, anything needs to be picked and harvested, a bunch of, uh, hops as always, and wonderful coffee beans. We'll probably start making coffee. Now that I have a source of the kegs, we'll probably make coffee as well. Hey kid, here's the recipe for a little treat my pappy used to make. Cook it slow. Man, everyone is giving me their pappy's recipes. Wiley, Pam, cheese cauliflower, ch clam chowder, it's great. If only I had a kitchen, I would be able to take advantage of this. But I do not, and so I cannot. But that's fine. Um, right. How much wood do we have? We need 450 wood total for the house. So we'll probably be going down to Cinder Snap over the course of checking for the, um, who, 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 who? Traveling saleswoman. Right. So for the traveling saleswoman, I'll bring the wood, and since we'll be down there, I'll bring... Avoid essence for Magnus Rasmodius, my master from another life. Uh, drop off the bait. We don't need the fishing rod right now, so that can go away as well. So, we need some food. We do need some food. What, do, what food do I want? We also definitely have enough... I need to go fishing in the ocean for more uh, ocean jelly. We get some more sea jelly, we get some more cave jelly, and then we make some more smokers, and that's the plan for that. Right, okay. So, let's go... Let's take some food. What food do I want to take with me? Um... Hmm. What food do I want to take with me? We have... Do we have stuff for... We have spice berries. I think I'm going to keep all of the forgeables on hand for the moment. And then... See... Grapes, right? Grapes. And then we'll just collect them as we go. And that way we can make more seeds. So more spice berries. This will help also consolidate the inventory in some small way. So that should be fine. Is there anything else? Is there anything else? Uh, do we want to break some geodes? Uh, we'll break some geodes next time we go down to Gunther. Uh, yeah, we have geodes as well. Um, any other forgeables? Uh, the grapes. Those are gifting grapes. Mm, it's fine. We have a lot of spice berries. Lots and lots of spice berries, but that's fine. Let's go down south, and over the course of going down south, uh, we'll save that sunflower for when we're picking the melons. It can stay and survive for a, another bit of time. So let's go see what the traveling saleswoman has to say. Has to say and has to sell, and then we'll go talk to Magnus, and we'll chop some trees, and then we'll probably go... Or I'll probably just chop trees until I have 450 that we need. A pomegranate. Do I need a pomegranate for anything? Fruit salad, fried mushroom, corn, fiddlehead fern, saplings, garlic, strange bun, 
Red Fez? Red, it's 8,000. I can't afford that right now. Oh, if only you were later. Oh, who knows when we'll find a Red Fez again. Oh, I'm sure we will. Oh, gosh. Do we need a pomegranate? It's $700. I can justify it if we need one. We need one for the artisan bundle. Ooh. Oh, but that's a guarantee, though. It's a guaranteed pomegranate. Do we need a pomegranate for the bulletin board at all? We've already donated one. Ooh. 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 Our fruit bag. I'm going to count. I'm going to put all of my money in one basket. That being the fruit bat cave. So let's give let's give Magnus a treat of this, you know, spirit of the shadows. And then we'll chop down trees until I have enough wood to buy a house upgrade. And then we'll meet back up at Robin's. Hopefully that doesn't take until she closes. This is imbued with potent arcane energies. It's so useful for my studies. Thank you, dear boy. Thank you so much. I don't expect it to take too long. So I'm going to chop trees. When does Robin close? Robin closes from f at 5 o'clock. So I think I'll... I'll cut some trees down along this path, work my way back up the farm, and cut everything at the top, and then hopefully by 5 o'clock we'll be at Robin's. So that's the plan for the immediate. I'm going to chop down trees and probably get forgeables as well. So that'll take me a hot minute. So I'll see you probably up by Robin's, maybe at around 3 to 4-ish, depending on how much wood we get and how quickly we get it. All right, we have got all of the wood, plus a little bit extra in case we have need of it. And I am here, Robin, to ask for you to upgrade my house. I have the 10 grand. I've got the 400 bits of wood that you need. And I would like to commission an expanded house. Thank you very much. I'll get started tomorrow. It should be finished in around three days. Well, take your time for that, ma'am. I very much eagerly await that house to be done. For the rest of the day, I do believe I am willing to go into the mines and uh, reluctantly farm for as much iron as I can get my hands on because I need more iron bars and I do not have a pickaxe to do it efficiently. No, I do not, but I'm going to go home, clear out the inventory. I am going to see if I can't make any explosives because that would make my problems disappear because there's no problems in life that cannot be solved with violent, prolific, expansive, and far-reaching explosive ordinance. I would be from Vault 34 if I were in the Mojave. Uh, drop off all of these things. I have so many spring seeds. Or summer seeds. Um, I'm going to... I have wood. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna do the plunge. I'm gonna do the plunge. I will do... I will... I will... I will allow you to keep 60 summer seeds. And I will take 50 of the summer seeds. And I will get my fiber. And we will make tea saplings. Yes, we will. We should be able to make 25 tea saplings. I don't know what I'm going to do with these tea, tea saplings. I don't know what I'm going to if I'm going to sell them. I don't know if I'm going to plant them. But I will make 20... I can only make 8 of them? Wow, I didn't have enough wood for that at all, did I? Oh, I didn't have enough wood for that in the slightest. Okay, that's fine. Where am I going to plant tea saplings? I genuinely thought I would be able to make a few... I thought I would be able to make a lot more. But I suppose that's the problems that we deal with in life. And I don't have nearly enough grapes to justify. Or, well, I can't I can't make any more even if I wanted to. Oh, that's unfortunate. Fine. All of you can go away except for the silver quality spice berries. Those I'm going to keep in my inventory. So what am I going to do? I need to decide what to do with those. I don't know what I'm going to... I don't know if I'm going to sell them. I'll sell three of them. Do I want to sell them? It takes 20 days to mature. I think I want to plant them right now. Where do I want to plant them? I have no idea where I would want to plant them. Like, I, I don't have a tea sapling area dedicated to this. I don't have garden pots, so I can't put them in other locations. And I now that I know I can take down the fence, I don't know if I want to do that. Honestly, I'll sell the three saplings, and then we'll see if I can make anything of that. Can I make bombs? What do I need to make bombs? Um, copper ore, coal, and iron ore. Do I have either of those in abundance? I have four bits of iron. I can make a single bomb. I do not have the resources for this. 
but I suppose... No, it's not. I'd rather keep the iron. All right, fine. Let's go to the stupid mines, and then we'll get as much iron as we can. I don't expect to get a lot, but I'm willing to spend the last day, or the last bit of Friday today. Because there's not a much else happening. Uh, actually, I want to cut through town, just in case there's any um, events. Well, I know there won't be events, but I want to check the bulletin board, just in case there's a quest. Because I don't know if there is or if there is not. But I will say this, the wheat and the hops are taking a lot longer than I expected them to. I have I have memories of them going much quicker. Like, you can do a bunch of that in, like, one day. Or, well, not necessarily a bunch, but you could do, like, at least one in a day. I could be incorrect, and clearly I am incorrect, but... Marnie needs a frozen tear. Um, I have one of those, and, well, we're going to the mines anyway, so I will... Pick one up if I find it and bring it over to her. Because I do need to make nice with Marnie. Just so I can get those pants. Because I do need to get Lewis's pants back. Even though, well, those aren't going to be the pants I give him. Because, well, that's the best kind of blackmail material in the entire world. And, you know, I kind of, you know, desperately desire that. Because if there's any way that I can give myself an advantage on that stupid crane machine, then I will take it. But yeah, let's go to floor 40 and just, you know, crank out as many floors and as much iron as we can get our hands on. Because that is the ultimate goal. Ooh, a frozen tier right there. If we can get more than one, that would be nice. And we can also technically work on dust sprites. Because I think I do need to make it a priority to get the dust sprites. Just because once we get the burglar's ring, that'll be very nice for coal gathering because we probably if the fish smokers are as powerful as they are then we need to make as many fish smokers as possible oh we are not oh that's an aquamarine and another frozen tier well we'll get some more mining experience as well and that'll be good that will in fact be quite good it won't hurt us at the very least no it will not i am still extremely curious about what's behind those doors that we found in Cinder snap. It's like, oh, you need the five skills at max level or something like that. That's what I got out of it, and I do want to check that out. So, whatever skill we get to 100 first will potentially be the thing we focus on first in that room. If there's challenges, I I can only assume there's challenges because I feel like if there's like challenges for Mr. Key's room, then there will be like, like if there's if the community center is, like, a tier 1 challenge, then once your skills are maxed, that's, like, a tier 2 challenge behind that door. And, or, well, not not the community center. I suppose the bulletin board and the notice board would be, like, the beginning game quests. And then, potentially, what's behind that door in Cindersnap would be, like, tier 2 quests. I don't have the wherewithal to mine rocks. I'm just gonna reload floors 40 45 and everything else for iron i'm not gonna dig for staircases that would just be a waste of my time and energy especially when i can get emeralds but the skill door if there are quests like i i have no idea what's behind those doors not a clue not a single clue let's go to 45 this time but if there are skills over there or challenges or whatever i'll do it in whatever order we unlock level 10 skills first so if i have like Farming level 10 by the time we get in there, we'll do farming first. <gasps> Crystal fruit. Wow, that's useless to me. I, and a uh, winter root. Wow, that's even more useless to me. Can I get... I suppose beating up the dust sprites is beneficial to us. Even if we don't get a lot of iron, getting the kill count up for dust sprites and slimes is definitely beneficial. Getting that burglar ring and slime ring would be the best thing that could happen to us. Go away. Go away. Go away, down to floor 50. We'll check that out. More iron, please. Lots of sprites, though. This seems like a different floor layout. I don't think I've... I, Because there's... there. I don't remember any floor layout having, like, this kind of snow dirt pattern below it. Or, like, in, in it. Like, this seems strange. Did, did Concerned Ape add new types of dungeon floors why is am i am i truly ignorant to this did i never did i go through 120 floors and never notice anything like that 
Like, knowing me, that's an entirely plausible, possible thing. But, like, I, there, there, there's no way... No, surely not. Am I truly that blind? I'd probably, I'm probably that blind. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. I wonder if there have been changes to, like, Skull Cavern, then. That would be... That'll be interesting to find out. I can't wait to go and check it out. 9.50. Uh, it's fine. Uh, I'm eating the spice berries mainly because, well, I don't have enough grapes to get more, uh, things. Uh, the mixed seeds. Or not the mixed seeds, the seasonal seeds. I always get that name confused. It's like the mixed seeds, the spring seeds, the seasonal seeds, or whatever they end up being. I can never remember the name right, but that's fine. Stop breaking rocks. You're not here to break rocks and find staircases. You're here to get iron. As much iron as you can. Uh, go to floor... Just swap between 55 and 45. There's nothing here. There is literally nothing on this floor. Why? How is it possible that there's nothing on this floor? There's nothing on this floor either. Except a bat and some dust spray. Oh, I'm not going all the way over there for that. No, I'm not. No, I am not. Go to floor 55. There are enemies here now. That's fine. I do want to... Is that the dwarf scroll that we need? Is the green one? No, I think I need the yellow one. That's sad. Oh, I need I need to be able to talk to the dwarf. I desperately... Because, like, I could technically buy bombs from him. But we have a lot of um, frozen tears. So, who wanted the frozen tears? Marnie. We'll go to Marnie and Sebastian, I suppose, then. And then we need to find a bit of iridium. We find one bit of iridium, and we can do... Um, the entirety of the boiler room, which is certainly beneficial because I really, really want those uh, rail carts. I very much want them. Not a lot of iron at all. Where is the iron? I only have enough for four bars. That's not nearly enough to satiate my metal deficiency. I need more. Only two. I have a perk that gets me more metal. I need more metal. It's getting late. Yes, of course it's getting late. This is a boring episode, but that's fine. As we all know, there are bound to be boring episodes in Stardew Valley. That is part and parcel to what we expect. Ghosts. <gasps> Ghosts. It's a whodunit mystery. Give me that iron. Stop floating away from me. Omni geode. Normal bits of wood. Will we be able to make it back to town or the house? Like, who knows? I think I need to get back to the house. Yeah, we need to... Oh, boy. We're not going to be able to get... I'm going to kill the ghost. We're not going to be able to get back to the house, are we? Oh, it's 1 o'clock. Oh, this is... Ooh. Ooh. We're going to cut this close. It's 1 o'clock. We need to get back to that. We're going to pass out. I have way too much money to pass out right now. I can't afford to be passing out in the dirt. Oh, God. We're going to pass out. Uh, Does that cost me money? Passing out costs me money. Does exhaustion cause? Oh God, this is it's 120. Oh, oh, it'll be it'll be a matter of pixels. It will be a matter of pixels. 120, 120, 120, 130, 130. Uh, we'll see at the very least how much we need to get halfway to the farm. The pale ale. We'll save that for tomorrow. Don't get distracted. 140. I think we might just barely make it. Don't get slowed down by our melons. 140, 140, 140. Hi, Mio, Nile. We're going to bed. 140. It's not even 150. How much money do we make from tea saplings? 750. 250 a piece? We could. Uh, it would be it, it, that 250. That's probably justifiable. Might want to sell those. I might want to sell my tea saplings in that case. Hmm. 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 Hmm, 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 hmm. The bookseller is in town today. Well, we'll check that out in the next episode. I want to pause time so I can roll smoothly into the next recording of the next episode. But with that, whether you watched this singular episode for 30 seconds or the entire thing, I appreciate you so much for sticking with me for a relatively boring episode. We got some iron and we upgraded the house. That is absolutely a benefit to us. Upgraded house, that'll be in a fantastic way to start off fall once we get there hopefully robin did say three days so i do expect to wake up on fall one with a big kitchen oh that'll be nice that will be nice so we got some mushroom logs we got a house upgrade and we got some more iron 
which is definitely something I can appreciate. So on the next episode, we'll be delivering some frozen tears, um, and we'll see what the last day of summer has to bring for us. Hopefully it's something good. So 30 seconds entire thing. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will see you on the next episode of Stardew Valley 1.6. Later.